I could steer that car forever. I don't even have to drive it. I just love to look at it. The most exciting thing about the car to me is when you look at the car sideways. And one thing that intrigued me the most was when you open up the back lid where the engine is. The whole back end comes up and you see this beautiful V12 with these double carburetors with trumpets sticking up. And the, the, the gearbox and the, 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 the tubular chassis here and all the technical parts, which is, in the end, is very simple. But back in, in, in the days, it was a very advanced car to the, to the era. And the beauty of the car, you know, the round fenders, the, the intake, the, the position of the lights, the way the lights are covered, and so on. So everything makes up the beauty of this car. Every angle you look at this car has got something very interesting. Because a Ferrari never gets old, you know? The design is it's always beautiful. My name is Remo Ferri, and uh, I own a 1964 Ferrari 250 Le Mans. To be able to achieve the dream of becoming a team owner and running a, a Ferrari, because that's what I wanted to do, it was one of the greatest things of my life. I became involved in becoming a private team because that's the dream that I wanted to leave. And Ferrari is what I do. I mean, I don't get involved with anything else. You know, Ferrari is the brand that I like to raise because as a mystique, has so much history, has so much to give. You see, the 250 Le Mans, it's a very limited production car. This is one number nine of 32 cars. And this particular car was driven by two famous well, Formula One drivers, Nino Vaccarella and Scarfiotti. They, they create history of Ferrari. This car was entered 38 races, 15 podium. It's gone through a war racing because that's the way it is in racing. You crash them, you rebuild them. It takes me back and say, this car was on the racetrack fighting to, to win the race. What more passion can you put behind this? When you put the foot on the accelerator and you push it down, when I mean, you hear those carburetors, those 12 cylinders screaming, it's music. When you sit on the 250 and then, I mean, it's Aluminum, seats, steering wheel, controls, that's it, and gear shift. That's how you do it. Driving the 250, it's an experience on their own because the car is bumpy. The car is very itchy and it's very fast. When you speak about Ferrari, there's no compromise. The Ferrari DNA is racing, it's design, it's technology, it's speed. It's the beauty of the whole thing. 